When I was about 14 years old, I was at my first Uprise Festival. I stood in a sea of people with tears streaming down my face as I peered into the heavens. My body was covered with hands coming from all different directions and everyone was praying, praying for me and the handful of other victims. Tommy Green was on stage performing with his heavy metal band Sleeping Giant and up until then I had never heard of them. But when I saw the joy that they brought to my friend, I reluctantly agreed to go regardless of being a bit out of my comfort zone. We stood clinging onto the barricade as if it was our source of life, and that's when he began to preach. Tommy Green had halted the show to talk to the crowd. It wasn't the typical thank you and God loves you. It was more than that. It was as if he was being led by God to speak directly to me. I remember hearing Tommy Green's story of his childhood sexual assault and being frozen in time. When he shared his story, I gripped harder onto the barricade until I couldn't feel my fingers. And that was when he asked for other victims to raise their hands for prayer. I can still see his eyes as they locked onto mine, begging me to forgive my attacker. He was pleading with the crowd to let go of their anger and of their pain. He implored the handful of victims in the crowd to lend forth forgiveness. It was like he could sense my reluctance. He locked eyes with me once more and called out to me. I know this is hard for you, but our God is full of love and forgiveness, and this pain will do no good for you. At that point in my life, I had never experienced a greater show of love or of faith in my 14 years of life. As hands engulfed my body and I shouted my forgiveness, my faith was set ablaze. Now here I am, four years later, with no resentment and no ill will towards my attacker. Here I am, four years later, no longer a victim, but a victor in Christ.